Hi everyone, it's Sue here. I have been really working hard on some layouts and really having a blast with them. Um, I'm finding that the Scraptastic kits um, are just so well put together that um, it's making the scrapbooking so much fun for me. <laughs> so um, I'm just really trying to use, um, you know, what I get in the kit and maybe use powder paper together that I would normally use or embellishments or whatever. So um, I am going to share um, some layouts with you. We'll see how far we get. I don't want it to go too long. But just to show you that um, I did order a whole bunch of kits all at once. Um, so I have the November and December scrapbook kits and then the August and September Project Life kits that I ordered. So you might see an assortment of, um, of products from the different months and from the different kits. So the first layout I'd like to share with you is this layout. It's a layout of bread, um, which I don't normally do a lot of pictures of food. Um, not for really any main reason, it's just I don't. Um, I try to, but for whatever reason I don't remember. But anyway, so we have this new food store in town. It's like humongous. It's like a mall inside. There's, it's like way too big. But anyways, they have this, this bread section. And they had bread that I love. I mean, the only place I've ever gotten this bread was in a restaurant here in New Jersey called Charlie Brown's. And <clears throat> as far as I know, there's only like two Charlie Brown's left. But anyway... The bread that they had, oh my gosh, it was a raisin walnut bread, and this is the exact bread. So I was thrilled to death. So that's why I captured a picture of it. So let me go ahead and explain what I did on the layout. Um, I have a lot on here, right? Um, it looks like a lot. But I guess I'll start up here in the corner. So we did receive um, these frames, and so I have... I'm trying to think who the heck the frames are by. Um, I forget, but anyways. So we have the frames. And this um, flare is actually one that I received from Etsy, from JW's Jazzy Buttons. And then what I did, the wood veneer, so there's glasses and heart. And I don't know if you can see, but I did go ahead and he embossed them with gold. And it was really um, Marissa from MAM1016 who inspired me to pull out that uh, my heat gun and it's so easy to use and yet I just for whatever reason um, don't use it but I do now so thank you Marissa and so I used some of the banners from the kit as well as some of the enamel dots and underneath here I just put a little bit of orange washi tape from one of the kits. I put the orange there because there's orange elsewhere on the page and I just wanted to pull the orange up into that corner as well into that little cluster. And then this sheet back here is a was a full 12 by 12 and I just cut it down to just um, you know cover the top you know, a little bit less than half of the page. So when I cut it, because it's the chevron, you know, I had to cut at an angle all the way over to get it to look like that. So, and I love it. I love it. Um, oh, and I also put um, just a strip of yellow paper there. And this brown paper is from um, That Away Collection from Studio Calico. So that's where the paper is from. And then over here, I have one of the um, pieces from the ephemera pack, as well as here's another one of the frames. This flare came in one of the kits, and it's nice because it's smaller, um, so it's not as dimensional. And this hay, I actually printed on the picture with an app called Rana Design, R-H-O-N-N-A. And the paper clip, oops, sorry, going out of 
view there. The paper clip is from the kit as well as the enamel dots. And what I did was I backed the picture on a yellow piece of paper and then I just took my black pen, my close to my heart pen, and I just did the faux stitching around. This um, paper clip is also from one of the kits. And this heart too, which I also, I don't know if you can tell, I did uh, heat emboss it with gold. And then this cluster over here, I took a bunch of that uh, washi tape and it's see-through and it does have days of the week on it, but I just, again, wanted to capture more orange over here. So I put the washi tape down first in another one of the frames. I went ahead and this um, wood veneer I just outlined the, the center heart right there. And this is a, it's a plastic um, camera and I put the enamel dot in the middle, also from the kit. And then this embellishment is also from the ephemera pack. So that is that layout. And I will share one more with you in this video and then I'll do another video. Okay, so this is the second layout and these two are gonna go side by side in my scrapbook album. So, I did try to keep a few things being the same and you know so I have banners on here I have the frame on here I have some of the wood veneer um, and like here's a wood veneer wood veneer the same as on the other layout um, so up here I just put a couple of the banners and a sequin in here and um, and some more of the washi tape. So that's two different kinds of washi tape. I put, <coughs> excuse me, the orange down first, then this multicolor on top, and then this on top of that, just to give it a little bit more um, substance to it. Then over here, so I put the sequins on top of the frame, and this wood veneer, I also heat embossed but with clear and I did it a couple times so it's nice and shiny I hope you can see the shine on it there we go that should do it so it looks really pretty then this is just a saying one of my friends had on her Facebook page and I just thought it was cute <clears throat> excuse me and I wanted to document it so like this paper um, this is from this is from a scraptastic kit but I think it's from a little bit older one. I don't know if it was from a month ago or two months ago, but the uh, 12 by 12 paper is cut and paste Amy Tangerine from American Crafts. So from that same ephemera pack that that flower was from on the other layout, um, there's the feather and the owl, got another paper clip. Um, the Scraptastic always sends these um, tabs, so I went ahead and used a tab. This is from the sticker sheet that comes with it and more of the um, sequins down here. And I also um, heat embossed with pink the little um, glasses and the heart. And let's see what else. And then just down here, I heat embossed with clear this wood veneer and put some more sequins and some more washi tape on the bottom, just like I did on top. So these are my two layouts for today. And if you have any questions, please give me a holler. I'd love to hear from you. Um, otherwise, have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.